Public Library. My name is Miss Caitlin, and today we are going to use our shakers in the songs towards the end of story time. So please grab a shaker or rattle for those songs. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Let's begin today by singing Hello, Hello. It's a repeat after me song, so everything I say, you should say too. Hello, hello. Can you clap your hands? Hello, hello. Can you clap your hands? Can you stretch up high? Can you touch your toes? Can you turn around? Can you say hello? Hello, hello. Can you stomp your feet? Hello, hello. Can you stomp your feet? Can you stretch up high? Can you touch your toes? Can you turn around? Can you say hello? <laughs> Good. Now we must also get our fingers ready by doing open, shut them. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Oh. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap, 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 creep them, crawl them, creep them, crawl them, right up to your chin, 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 open up your mouth real wide, <gasps> but do not let them in, open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap, Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap, lap, lap. Now it's time to talk about our Livermore Reads Together Black History Month Person of the Day. Today I'm featuring Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris is our Vice President. She is the first woman to have ever had that job. She is also the first Indian American person and the first black person to have ever been vice president of the United States. Now, how could she be both Indian American and black? Well, that's because her parents came from different places. Her parents were immigrants, and that means that they moved to the United States from somewhere else. Her mom came from India and her dad came from Jamaica, but she is all American. <laughs> Does your family look like that? Every family looks a little different. <laughs> Did you know Kamala Harris grew up not far from here? Yeah, she grew up in Oakland. Learn all sorts of other facts about her life and her career in this book and others in our library catalog. Time to sing a song. I haven't used my ukulele in a while. Today we're going to sing This Land is Your Land. Ready? This land is your land.
book. Today we're going to read Maisie's Scrapbook by Samuel Narp and Joe Loring Fisher. This is all about a little girl whose family comes from different places. Do you know my family comes from different places? Yeah. My dad's family came from England and Ireland. My mom's family came from Mexico. Ask your grown-ups, where does your family come from? Maybe they moved here recently, or maybe they've been here a long time. Every family is different. So we're gonna take a look at Maisie's family. I am the little girl who saves the world from Anansi the spider. Dada tells me stories of Anansi in his flying basket. Mama tells me a bull is not a pet. I am like Afia, the bull rider. Maisie, age five. It's a picture of her dad when he was six. Mom when she was nine. Little baby Maisie and her and Teddy. <laughs> and there she is, drawing in her scrapbook. Maisie rubs petals between her fingers. Tears roll down her cheeks. Mama won't let her play with the bull by the fence. It's usually a good idea to leave big animals alone. She's the little girl in Dada's tall tales. Do you know what a tall tale is? It's like a folk tale or a fairy tale. A traditional story. Mama says tomato. Dada says amo. They hug her in the same way. She's as relentless as spring rain. Maisie hides behind the shrubs. Mama looks for her behind the trees. A flock of birds cheers them on. Looks like they're playing hide and seek. Dada points out turtles swinging on chandeliers of stars in the night sky. Have you ever looked up at the stars and pretended to see pictures? What constellations are. Mama wears linen. Dada wears candy cloth. They praise her in the same way. She's as bright as a summer day. Maisie hurls leaves into the air. She wants them to stay in the trees. The bull frightens her into Mama's arms. Uh-oh. But she's safe. Dada shows her clouds painting pictures of ancient worlds in the skies. You can look at clouds too and imagine that they look like pictures. Mama cooks risotto. Dada co cooks jollof rice. They nag her in the same way. She's as spirited as autumn leaves. A smile runs across Maisie's face. She sits in Mama's rocking chair. She bucks and pulls the horns of a bull made of wood. <laughs> Look, she's pretending. The rocking chair is a bull. She's the hero in Dada's tall tales. Mama plays viola. Dada plays marimba. They love her in the same way. She's as pure as winter snow. They're making music together. See, there's the marimba. It's a percussion instrument. And there's the viola. That's a string instrument. My ukulele is a string instrument too. Oh, and there's some more drawings for her. <laughs> the end. Now it's time to 
sing another song. Today we're going to sing If You're Happy and You Know It. Ready? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, spin around. Whee! If you're happy and you know it, spin around. Whee! If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, spin around. Whee! If you're happy and you know it, jump up and down. If you're happy and you know it, jump up and down. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, jump up and down. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. Very good. Do you feel happy today? time to use our shakers. First, we're going to sing our opposite song. Ready? We shake our shakers up and down, up and down, up and down. We shake our shakers up and down, shake our shakers. We shake our shakers front and back, front and back, front and back. We shake our shakers front and back, shake our shakers. We shake our shakers left and right, left and right, left and right. We shake our shakers left and right, shake our shakers. We shake our shakers quiet and loud, quiet and loud, quiet and loud. We shake our shakers and loud shake our shakers <laughs> good and now we're going to sing shake your shakers up shake your shakers up and shake your shakers down shake your shakers dancing all around the town dancing on your shoulders dancing on your head dancing on your knees now tuck them into bed <laughs> Good job shaking your shakers. So that's it for today's story time at home with the Livermore Public Library. Thank you so much for joining us today. Before we say goodbye, let's sing one more song together. We're going to sing We Clap Our Hands Like This. We clap our hands like this. We clap our hands like this. We clap our hands with all our friends we clap our hands like this we stomp our feet like this we stomp our feet like this we stomp our feet with all our friends we stomp our feet like this we wave goodbye like this we wave goodbye like this we wave goodbye to all our friends we wave goodbye like this goodbye everybody and i will see you next time <laughs>